Hello, my name is Josh. I work as a pharmacy technician in a hospital setting. Most of my days at work are typically in the room where medications were, are prepared, is where I walk in and see if anything needs to be taken care of right then and there. I will talk to my coworker who is working the morning shift and see if they need to be relieved so they can take a break from um, compounding the medications. Uh, there's times where I would go back and check up on the warehouse order which provides our supplies, um, our IV fluids, um, which are, you know, the dextrose and uh, sodium chloride, which are the main fluids we use at all times in this compounding room. Um, there's, and then after that, I will, I will put on what they call the suit, which is the gown, the hat, the footies, and the gloves. And from there, I will step up um, to a little counter where I can start preparing, you know, the medications. I will grab the label, f which is generated from the pharmacist, which will come off the printer. I'll grab that label and grab the appropriate medication for that patient, and I will, you know, enter it into this, this cabinet, I should say, where I compound it, where I take a, let's say, sterile water, and I will pull put so much uh, milliliters of that stir water into the vial of the medication which is it is housed in and then from there I will shake it or swirl the medication until it becomes a, a clear type liquid where you can actually withdraw however many milliliters is required for that dose for that patient and from there, I will slap the label on the medication bag and just send it off the door to be delivered to the medication floor, to the nursing unit where the patient or patients are located. Uh, there's times where I prepare literally hundreds of medication orders. Um, my typical day starts off at about 1.30 and it ends at 10. Uh, there's other times where I work, uh, I periodically work in the main pharmacy, which is r similar to a retail setting where you answer phones, answer the window, um, you fill medication orders where you have, you count pills at times. Um, those hours vary per position within a hospital setting. Um, also, the stress level can either be very high or very low or right there in the middle of the stress level range. The job requirements for a pharmacy technician is to be nationally certified, which allows you to, to get employment as a pharmacy tech anywhere in the United States. But before you sit for the national certification test, I recommend that the students get into a pharmacy tech program which will allow them to acquire the skills which will benefit them in their future employment as a pharmacy technician, um, regardless of whatever state they choose to gain that employment. Um, also, um, various states require the individuals to be licensed. However, it varies, like I was saying, from state to state. So you will, so the individual will have to check up on that state to see if they need to get their mandatory license as a registered pharmacy technician. The best part of my job as a pharmacy technician is knowing that I'm a part of a team that's helping the patient get better so they can go home, be with their family, and go about their daily lives. The worst part of my job is working every other weekend and working the holidays, specifically Christmas and Thanksgiving. My final advice for anyone pursuing to get into the pharmacy tech field of work is to do research online to get your own, get, obtain your own knowledge of, you know, what the expectations are, what the pay rate is, you know, and that definitely varies from state to state. And also 
find someone whether it's a local retail setting or a hospital setting just talk to a, a pharmacy technician already in the field and they'll be more than happy to set aside a couple minutes of their time to give you a brief description of what their daily job is and you know what all goes on in their pharmacy and also stick with school maintain decent grades because that will be a great benefactor later on when you get into the program itself.